when we read this amount, $47.50 or $47.50, we know that the decimal tells us there are more digits to the right of the 7. So the 5 and the 0, or the 50, represents 50 cents, which is part of the $47. Now when we write the amount of $47, we know there's an invisible decimal to the right of the 7 because we might have to add more digits or cents to it. We just don't always write the decimal. The same is true for whole numbers. In the whole number 47, there is an invisible decimal to the right of the 7. We just don't always write it. This is because we often have to write decimal numbers to the right of the decimal point to show digits that are part of the 47. So we read this number as 47.25 or 47 and 25 hundredths. Where the 25 or the digits 2 and 5 are part of the 47. We need to write our decimal here to show that the 2 and the 5 are a part of 47.